In her book, A Royal Waste of Time, The Splendor of Worshipping God and Being Church for the World, Marva Dawn called churches to stop thinking about worship in terms of what it could do for how we feel and return to seeing it as a sacred invitation to honour God with our lives and our words. A story she told summed up her attitude. A congregant came up to her after a service to complain about one of the hymns the church sang, and she told them, It's okay, it wasn't really about you anyway. Friends, it's easy to say that something is more fun than the church, that the kids would enjoy, sports, sleeping in, running errands. But we forget that the purpose of the church is not to entertain us. Gathering together fulfills a much greater purpose than simply having something to do on Sunday mornings. We need to remind each other of who God is. We need to sit under the preaching of God's word so that we might know Him more. We need to be surrounded by people who can encourage us in our faith and in good deeds. We need to sing and speak and read so that we might remember the promises of God. And the list goes on. Mark Dever summarizes the purpose of the church gathering in this way. The proper ends for a local congregational's life and actions are the worship of God, the edification of the church, and the evangelization of the world. These three purposes in turn serve the glory of God. Hebrews 10, the author gives his fourth warning on the danger of despising Christ, the Son of God. As a result, they continue to sin, but instead draw near to God, hold on to our faith, and encourage each other by gathering together to worship Him. Hebrews 10, 21 says, Since we have a great priest over the house of God, let us draw near with a sincere heart in full assurance of faith. Let us hold fast to the confession of our hope without wavering, for he who promised is faithful. And let us consider how to stimulate one another to love and good deeds, not forsaking our own assembling together, as is the habit of some, but encouraging one another, and all the more as you see the day drawing near. Amen.